This is what's in your head. We have to deal with this just very quickly. I'm bouncing through these things very fast. What counts is not the content of your thoughts. It's your relationship to the thoughts. Now, let me get into that a little bit deeper. For example, secret sauce is changing your relationship to your thoughts and emotions rather than trying to change their content. I'll give you an easy way to frame this. Cognitive fusion is when you choose imagined threats that only exist in your head to be your reality instead of the actual world around you, much like going to a movie and seeing, you know, um, of this. Okay, so the next one, emotionally overtaken by the fictional presentations on the screen. So you can imagine that becomes reality. Well, that's great for horror films because they suck you in and you think, oh my God, you know, Jason is really going to kill for the hundred thousandth time. But you also create realities in your head that are fictional because you look at a worst case scenario and then you start getting scared and you start living in that. What if? And what if this happens? And what if that happens? And you take yourself down a rabbit hole that you can't get out of. So there's an easy fix. Diffusion is realizing you're in a movie theater and that the dinosaurs do not exist and cannot harm you. Take that play, take that scenario, take that world you've created for yourself that's so horrible and see it projected on a screen and see yourself sitting there in the theater watching it. And it becomes two-dimensional and you can get up and leave or turn it off. Or another technique is turn it to black and white and then turn it off. The process of taking the color out of it takes the, the fear and the reality out of it and then you turn it off. Very simple to do. All you have to do is practice. Um, anyway, this is, again, I forgot there was a third one. But diffusion can get distance from our thoughts. That movie theater. Um, if, you, if you take the movie theater analogy, you're looking at it, not from it. And that's it. Those are my slides.